Yeah, that's all you can do. What? Well, hello, Hypnos. So, you lost a duel to the death with an exalted bright sword, did you? They're pretty much the best of the best, so don't feel bad. It had to happen. But if it's any consolation, it'll probably happen again. I sure hope not. Probably. Uh, yep, conversations with Hypnos. It is said that sleep is a cousin of death. That turns out to be not quite correct, insofar as the two, in fact, are brothers. Born to Nyx herself. The former of the two, we call him Hypnos. He whiles away, half sleeping, watching over the pool of sticks in the foyer of the house. Taking stock of those arriving in the master's domain or returning to it. The Hypnos may be lacking in propriety, he brings a certain cheer, however unconventional, into the grim proceedings of the house. He is pretty cheerful. Oh. Oh. Uh. Let's figure out what's going on here. I've done the best I could preparing him. Though I'm fearful it was not enough. No one ever has escaped this place. Your expertise has readied him, Achilles. Yet I sense it is your confidence in him which spurs him on. Do not lose faith in yourself now, lest soon he do the same. My faith is prone to shakiness at times. Eh, I can't blame Achilles for my poor performance. What? So Thanatos is here now. Go about your business, Sag. What if Lord Hades saw us chatting like this now? I risked everything by helping you out there and still you failed. Turns out there's quite a lot of dead to fight down in the underworld. Though I probably got farther than I would have thanks to you. Um, maybe. We did take a lot of damage trying to win that race. Always happy to oblige. Especially when it causes me to risk my station. To risk everything I've worked for. How does he... Okay, so he's similar to Dusa, where he disappears after talking to him. check in with the house contractor. Yeah, we might be able to afford something. But let's give... How's my favorite boy doing, huh? Let's give Cerberus a pet. Do not let him manipulate you, Cerberus. Yeah, we'll give him a little chat. Notoriously vicious Cerberus is watching quietly his master's court. Back soon, boy. Yeah, let's talk to our father. Blood and darkness, but this place is falling apart. Nobody works an honest day down here. Father, everybody's dead. Give them a break. What would you even know of honest work? At least the wretched dead yet honor me as lord. I cannot say the same for you. Eh. Where'd Orpheus go? Looks like Orpheus isn't around. Speaking of Dusa. Oh, hey, you brought some fish. You could smell it all the way from down the hall. That's great. The head chef can take it off your hands. Should be right in the back of the lounge, like always. Thanks for helping us out, Prince. Oh, you're welcome, Dusa. Um, sure. Looks like Cerberus is a MVP again. Excellent work, Cerberus. Go ahead and turn in our fish. Here's the catch of the day. Ooh, 20 Until more gems. Time. That should be helpful. Uh, what kind of special deal do we have? We've come for questionable deals. A Titan's blood for 200 gemstones. I'm already going to say no to that. Because, see, so it takes 50 for a nectar, which would mean 500 for a diamond. A thousand for an ambrosia. So yeah, it's a thousand gemstones for a titan blood, essentially. That does not seem like a good deal. Um, actually, we can't afford any of the work orders yet. Alright. Got some saving up to do. Oh, we... Do have something complete, maybe? Scratch one off the fated list. Oh, there we go. We met all of the Chthonic colleagues. 
Thanatos must have been the last one. Same with Electo and Tisephone. We just recently unlocked them. Good to have friends in low places. So ten keys should be helpful. Uh, we're getting a little bit close to finishing some of them. We might have to plan some of that out soon. All right. That means we have enough keys to unlock the next set of talents. How else can I improve? So, what do we got here? Deep pockets. Start each escape attempt from the House of Hades with some wealth. Uh, ten obols per rank. Or golden touch. Gain wealth when you clear an underworld region. Plus 5% of your current obols per rank. Oh, those both sound pretty good. This one may be better if we don't spend anything early. I think that's how we'll end up unlocking enough obols to buy like the Titan blood if we can make it up to the surface. Maybe the other. This one here is more for early purchases. I'm also wondering if before we spend any more points, if maybe we should like now we have to save up 20 keys. Uh, what's thick skin? Raise your life total plus five per rank or high confidence. Deal bonus damage while your life total is at 80% or above plus 5% per rank. So if we stay high health, we can deal more damage or we could have more max health. Hmm. Trying to okay, it's over here. Reset talents. Let's try this mirror stuff again. Apparently, we've spent eleven hundred darkness. Some of these seem better than others, like dark regeneration. I think it'd be better for healing rather than the three per room. So sixty percent of the darkness we gain will be health. Oh, actually. Darn it, I don't want to spend another key. I was just thinking, did we have enough for the third death defiance? Or do we go for stubborn defiance? I don't know, the death defiance just seems too useful. However, I think stubborn defiance would have helped us out better last time. Hmm. We'll try stubborn defiance. An additional dash or 50% damage and dodge for two seconds when you dash just before getting hit. Two seconds isn't very long. A second dash could avoid us getting hit better. Probably go for fiery presence. Bonus attack and special damage when striking undamaged foes. So yeah, we could deal an extra 75% damage. Uh, how about this golden touch? Max is out at 15%. Thick skin. I need more darkness. Okay, we need more darkness to raise our max health. But that already boosts us up to 80. And I think we save. The casts aren't as important and I don't utilize it very much. Usually if it's if I get a good ability for casts, I'll use it. Done. So we'll save up. Yeah, should be all of that. I got Skelly over here. Say Skelly. Don't suppose you'd care to tell me how the infamous twin fist of Malfon came to be right here in this very courtyard, would you? Nope. Not any of my business, pal, which is to say I didn't see a thing. And even if I did, it isn't what I'm paid to do. Don't you have someone in your fancy house there paid to keep watch over stuff like that? Ask them. All right, maybe I will. Yeah, I thought it was Achilles that had to deal with these weapons. Uh, we'll equip this for bonus darkness. My blade. 
And... Stygius, you're revealing your past. We can get a couple aspects. Well, we can aspect a nemesis, or we could level up aspect of Zagreus. I think we should focus on clearing it with Zagreus first. The form in which the blade of the underworld first revealed itself, bonus attack speed, and move speed. It's only 3%, but... My aspect of Stygius grows stronger. What kind of sorcery was that? Hopefully we can get some more Titan blood soon. Alright, I'm ready. It's been a little while since we've used this thing. A new addition to the old collection. Yeah, I think the only new ones are Artemis and Ares. Basically start off with them and have a 10% chance to be rare or better. I say we save that for when we're trying to... Uh, whatchamacallit... Finish out their... Uh, prophecies. Uh, still want to try the cosmic egg. It didn't go so well for us last time. Where was it? We could try going for this. Attack special and cast each deal plus 50% damage while not empowered by Boon. Like, taking that at the very beginning is the best time to take that. And then maybe we can switch it up later. Either way, we can level it up and see what kind of bonuses we get. Go with that one. Seems good enough for now. All right, one more time. And we got Poseidon. He's got some good early game stuff. Especially if we can get Dionysus and get their duo. Mightily impressed with your ability to call those rivers there of all the denizens of my domain. Your crusty father's not entitled to the bounties of the sea, but on my limitless authority, you are. You have my rod of fishing. Now have this. What is this? Ooh. You have a greater chance of, to find a fishing point in each chamber. Fish spawn chance plus 20%. And it's... Uh, only thing available. All right, let's catch some fish. Prophecy foretold. I wonder what prophecy was just foretold. All right, some bonus damages from them being uninjured and from not having a boon paid off there. And we got a lot of these keys to save up. Bring us. Heads up. All set. I can use that back home. Ah, uh, we could go see Zeus or Dionysus. I was just talking about how Dionysus and Poseidon have a great duo. Could probably win the run for us. Stand down or suffer. feast like you have never seen you mark my words now take this and good luck all right we've had all of these and they're all super weak I guess we'll go with trippy shot your cast lobs a large explosive the burst into festive fog oh apparently we've talked to him enough uh, perhaps I ought to feel a kinship with the easygoing son of Zeus, for it is said that he has some mortal blood in him, not just divinity. This may explain why he, among Olympians, is so well enjoyed or so well loved by mortal kind, because he loves them back. 
bringing unto them more joy than suffering for the most part. Being un rather unlike the other gods in this regard, he nonetheless maintains a careful distance from the underworld, generally severing his ties with all his mortal followers upon the moment of their deaths. Why confront the woes of the dead when you can live an eternal feast? Okay. Uh, there's some darkness which could heal us, or a key, which we need to save a lot of. Some dumb damage there. Not the end of the world, though. Okay. Didn't take damage from that trap. Just based off when it ended. It's also a fishing spot up here. Always time to fish. Wow, a skill scion. Skill scion. Glad he said it, because I would have had no idea how. There's a monstrous sea creature that thrashes somewhere in Poseidon's waters far above. We're very careful to avoid sailing across her trenches, even in my sailing days. This rare breed is reminiscent of her dozen heads. Hopefully that's valuable. And I am happy to see health right away. That was something we've suffered on last run. Mostly because whenever we saw it, there was something else we wanted to. Dead. That's better. We got a shop. Which right now we have that thing that we want to save our money. Uh, ensure a fishing point will spawn ahead. Nah, not that important. We'll save our money. And a nectar. Very nice. I don't remember which gods we still have to give that to. I know Thanatos is going to need one. Uh, Aphrodite. Athena still needs one. And Demeter. So we got Dionysus again. Or a shop. We're trying to save our money, so shop is not the right call. Drop a bomb in the fog. Stay standing in it like a dummy. Should be able to stun him and then just dash away from the bomb. Anyone else? In the name of Hades. Here we go. High tolerance. You take less damage while standing in festive fog. Nice. After party would also be fantastic. Especially with our uh, revival. This means we'll leave every encounter at least 40%. But we'll go with the fate of choice, a high tolerance. Probably not the best strategic move. And opals won't be bad. I mean, it's our only choice. Done his work up. I can quite go where I wanted it. Worked out though. Looked like it was aiming somewhere else. A lot of these little witches. What do we have here? Pick that up. Looks like we go see chaos. Uh don't want to spend any money if I can avoid it. We'll spend some health, though. 
hit me. This might end up being a mistake. That would be convenient. Uh, extra cast. Special does more. Oh, life total reduced by 38. Then any gemstones or darkness worth 80% more. Go with that. Now here's a tough one. I want gemstones, but we need a little bit of a heal. We'll go gemstones. Armor's broken. Gemstones for the house. More gemstones or Sisyphus. Can I go see your buddy Sisyphus? I know we're basically getting darkness from it, but it's also a chance to talk to him. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Look, Prince, I don't hold grudges. You know that. Push this boulder long as I have, you move past the petty stuff. So, just want you to know, in case you make it out this time, it's been a real pleasure. Feelings mutual, sir. Someday you'll have to tell me all about how you tricked father. I might learn a thing or two. We're we'll gonna go darkness. Sure thing. Sh should get a heal Cheers, from mate. it. Yep. Perfect. So depending on how much his heal does, we would never even need that one anymore. See you again, right? Nice when those guys aren't armored. They just kind of sit there and spin in place. So shop or a palm of power. I'm trying to save my money. So I guess we'll, since I wouldn't spend any of it, let's go palm of power. Olympus. Uh, probably go with the high tolerance for now. The fishing point. Very nice. Might end up with multiple fish. But this, they got a hellfish. Think that's new? Yep. From the looks of them, they must have once been stowaways on the outer hull of Charon's boat. Fixing themselves just below the waterline, securing passage from the surface down into the depths via the river Styx. Cool. And we should be able to heal up from the darkness we get from here. Is it going to be? I'm back, Meg. <laughs> I have to level with you, Zagreus. For all we've been through, never once have I wanted you to meet my sisters. 
Can't imagine why not. We had a lovely time getting to know each other. We laughed, we cried. My only regret was that you couldn't be there yourself. You don't know what you're saying. There's a reason that they're not permitted in the house. Oh, come on. One of us is going back there now. Hopefully it'll be you, Meg. You have to be a little careful. Do have her death defiance thing, her stubborn defiance. That could might be wise. Once we get closer, let's take a hit on purpose to set it. You are a waste of time. Well, that wasn't on purpose. It's not damage over time. Darn it. Okay, we might lose. During this mega fight. I was a little bit too close for comfort. I did it. A curse of chaos has expired. Nice. Fortunately, I think it was a little bit after that reward, so it didn't proc. That's still fine, though. We got our max health back. Things are looking on the up and up. The Erinyes, known also as the Furies. They are the trusted sentinels of Lord Hades charged with torturing the worst of mortal kind and ridding the underworld of any fool enough to trespass where they do not belong. They'll just have to try harder next time. I don't know. They almost got me that time. And our stubborn defiance should come back. Yep. Plus 60 Karen's ovals just for saving. This will finish healing us. Don't bother asking how come all my keepsakes are here. Uh, might keep this just because we still, we haven't even used our special to be perfectly honest, but we're still utilizing the attack bonus. Uh, nothing I want to sell off and nothing here worth buying. See you Tartarus.
change of scenery at least. Looks like we get to go see our buddy Hermes. Slam dances. At least favor. Well, any of the bombers. The fact that that one stood in the lava is very nice. Bomb, but oh well. Wants to bring you in on something, boss. The reason that Uncle Poseidon got to you before I did is I let him. He's under the impression he's as spry as ever. <laughs> I can dash more times in a row. Or swift strike. I think we go with the fate of choice. Three dashes now, and a fishing spot. What lurks in the river Phlegathon? Thank you, Poseidon. Got you. Another crustacean. That is another crustacean. It's kind of hoping for something new, but I think because of Poseidon, we should have plenty of opportunities. First chance at the Daedalus Hammer. Or health. Daedalus hammer. Gotta be. Okay. Not only did I not get him where I wanted, I took a hit while attempting that. May I help you? Oh, these are all new ones. Your special hits twice, but no longer knocks foes away. Or your special hits a wider area and deals 20% damage. Or your attack deals plus 200% damage, striking foes from behind. Let's go with Saddle Shadow Slash. That's a blade. We'll try to focus hitting foes from behind, I guess. And if they're undamaged, we should probably be able to one shot them. Uh, let's go for the gems. And it should be a double reward from it being a skull, plus 80% from our boon of chaos. Oh, and it's a fishing spot. there. Yep, 18. So that all worked out like I thought it would. Uh, we need some heals. Let's go fishing. Right there. Slobug. I think that's another one we've had before. The uh, little bubbles popping up made that challenging. Oh, 
here we go. Double chance for the duo boon. And another fishing spot. Just gotta survive. The gods want me to choose. Let's go Poseidon first. Whenever Dionysus calls a feast, I'm turning up sooner or later, hear me, nephew? So make room for one more blessing and let's go! Hurrah! Oh, wow. This would stack well with that, uh... Whatchamacallit? Chaos, man. Poseidon's strength. Oh, come on, Zack. Now that was not the choice I would have made. You messing with me, man? Alright, I'll mess with you. Okay, last time we faced Dionysus and as we died. Let's try not to do that again. Don't take it personally, Dionysus. Luckily, this is a big old area. Now he's angry. So hopefully it'll be easier to avoid all that stuff. I suppose it's actually a better chance of more of them popping up where I don't see them. Okay, this is kind of not going well. Thinned out the numbers a little. That's not what I want to see. Get dead. Okay, I'm gonna get my cast. Wherever it went off to. There it goes. At the fines. Not, so Not the end of the world. But stubborn fines. Hey, now that was quite a sight. I gotta hand it to you, man, and you deserve this. Here. Uh, Dionysus' aid. Not getting what I'm aiming for. But this is a fate of choice, so we'll go with it. Uh, your call and flux hangover on foes all around you. Max gauge will be 9 seconds. Prophecy fulfilled again. Okay. Come, fishies. It's a fight. It's a crustacean. Nice. Yeah, apparently we found all of those we need. The armored heat-proof carapace of the crustacean makes it perfectly suited to quietly surviving, if not thriving, in the fire river slashing all the way across Asphodel. In ocean waters, similar creatures serve as easy prey, but not this magma loving variety, which tends to be left alone. So some do swim up from the riverbed in search of companionship. Uh, gain up to 25 of those, which should be an extra 130%. If those numbers add up, it might be 80% and then 50% of that, or vice versa. We'll try it. It's dangerous because we don't have a revive. That was a good revive. I agree. Oh, don't stand on the lava. Ugh, why do I bother? 
peace and quiet. I'll be updated. I don't think it's from Bone Hydras. Maybe the Wave Makers? One time scions of so many long forgotten cults, which worship monsters slain by heroes at some point. These remnants of the living yet possess capacity to give a certain shape to diabolic energies. Within these waves of devastation lie their memories of their fate fill er, hate filled transgressions, which they relive and recreate again and again, much like the ocean's wave lapping somewhere against brittle and uncaring shores. Do we have any more of these floating around? Not that I can tell. Nope. So, 18. Very nice. And a nectar. That was, uns that was surprising. Okay, not quite. Actually, that's not even 100%. Eh, yeah, that's fine. I'll take them. Still a lot. But the nectar. Unexpected. And I'm mighty grateful for it. Uh, Athena, who we still have to gift a nectar to. Ares. Or health. I think we go Athena. We'll go ahead and gift her a nectar. The health has probably been the smarter choice. Away we go. Especially on the barge of death. Utilize the stubborn defiance here. It's getting closer. Lady Athena. We'll go ahead and give her a gift. I'm indebted to you, goddess, for all that you and your side of the family have done for me. Well, it simply isn't in my nature to allow such offerings to go unanswered, noble cousin. In turn, I wish for you to have this with my compliments. Lady Athena, thank you. Got the owl pendant. I so look forward to our meeting face to face amongst the gods, dear cousin. Olympus shall be merrier and wiser once you're here. We also had something uh, pop up. Reduce damage from foes, 7%. It's a fate of choice, we'll go for it. Athena's power. Prophecy foretold. That's happening a lot. I'm not sure what all we're getting. Oh, it popped up because we gave her a nectar. Ooh. Uh, Eurydice, I think her name was. She's always singing. We haven't heard it in a while either, so I'll probably listen. What's going on? No burdens, no further debts to be paid. Atlas, can rest as weary bones. The weight of the world. Oh. 
I like her singing. From within a humble residence in Asphodel reverberates the golden sounding voice of Lorne Eurydice, who once attempted to escape the underworld and failed utterly, much like Prince Agrius. Oh, that's good to know. We're like minded souls. You watch yourself, old man. Oh, we can give her a gift. Oh, that's right. Eurydice, thank you for making me feel welcome in your pleasant home. Can't say the same for most places I've been lately. I have a small gift I wanted you to have. Oh, that's awful sweet of you, your royal majesty. Bringing me fresh ingredients like this. You know what? Here's something for you two. Help keep you safe out there. Thanks so much. The evergreen acorn. Nice. Sing when you're happy. Sing when you're not, your royal majesty. Uh, let's see. Up to two random boons of yours to upgrade the next rarity. Underworld delicacy. Up to four random boons of yours gain one level. Or the next three boons you find have upgraded rarity. I think for now we go refreshing nectar and hope to get that duo boon eventually. That's definitely something to pick up better early. It'll be my pleasure. And we just haven't had that opportunity. Oh, a shop. Trying to save her money. Bye now. Take care. Didn't mean to hit you. Probably not gonna buy anything. Although a heal might be worth it. I think we'll be fine. You must have a lot of stops around these parts, don't you, Kiron mate? Most of the dead are here in Asphodel, correct? I'll just have a look around. Yeah, the Hydra is probably one of the easier bosses. When things go well. You should have a stubborn defiance in case things don't. You come to fulfill my father's wishes. Oh, this is the worst one though. The one of the ads. My thing didn't land. Doesn't that like a dummy? That's not gonna be nice. We also are a lot closer range than I normally am when I fight these guys. There's a phase transition. Try to use a cast on this guy. Really neat. I was say, I need you to move your head out, buddy. The fact that that guy's armored sucks. Obviously, I went the direction I threw it. Slow and steady.
have the greater call. We'll save that for the multiple heads. Things. I don't know where that other thing went off to. Took too much damage there. I was about to say, we did plenty of damage to those heads. But now it should be the definition of playing it slow. Just looking for ads. I know they're getting ready to come up. I threw it into the fire. I might play super slow and build up another greater call. Especially because I just took damage there. And that's not going where I wanted it to. Crap. Know where he was. Oh, thank you, hangover damage. So scary, so close. Got you. Big heal coming here, though. Feels like we lost Karen's ovals. I don't remember spinning any. Off to taint Elysium again? Yeah, we'll use a fountain because we have to. Nothing there I want. Alright. This has not been a great spot for us. Get out of this damn heat. Fishing up here. I think we've never fished up here, so this should be new. Ah. Yep, I let it get away. It took longer to bite than I expected. Strongbow. 
Uh, your thrust deal is 200 or plus 100 percent damage and has a 40 critical chance. Your attack fires a wave that pierces foes, dealing 30 damage. Your special hits twice, but no longer knocks foes away. Uh, okay, the thrust is every third part of the strike. Okay, we'll try that. Let's go, Stygius. That one. Hopefully we have another opportunity to some fish up here. I feel dumb that I wasted that one. Here we go, max health. Take that over Palm of Power any day. I'm summoning the crits. Come meet my blade. These things even have a back to back stab. So I think we just took extra damage. Max health is helpful. See what came out of that trove here in a moment. Or what's gonna come out of the trove. Karen's ovals. Not bad. But then a palm of power to follow all this up. How bad could it be? Not super excited. We have a pet problem. Let's make this quick. I also realized why we didn't get the gem bonus. It was because it wasn't a room reward. Like, we got the bonus from uh, Chaos Boon, but not from Poseidon, because that only counts for room rewards. Glad I put in the order for a fountain chamber in this area. Oh. So, this is what a, those things we've been buying are. Power of the gods. Uh, I think we go. Do we go defensive or more Dionysus damage? This thing really saved our butt, so we'll go with that. Within the delicately hewn constructions of Elysium exist places of peace so utterly serene and absolute as mortal kind is seldom to experience during the average short and often painful coil. Is this really as good as it gets for mortal kind? So that kind of paid off. And another opportunity to redeem myself for fishing. What lurks in the River Lethe? Come on out. I got a clam. <laughs> The common clam is plentiful within the misty waters of the river Lethe. Flowing through the hills and valleys of Elysium, its shell, most of the time, is shut so tight it cannot be opened. Alright. Also, we really need some boons, so... Help me out, Poseidon. No, oh, it's the butterfly chamber. Yeah, I don't know what we took all of that damage from. We 
it just took a lot, but... Sinister ball of butterflies. Yeah, that was a pain I accept this message. Uh, this will give us some healing. Or do we go fate of choice? I think we go fate of choice. We've been sticking to that. This would be nice for some attack damage, but it does not synergize with our third strike if we're knocking people away. LB updated. Oh, got Can't enough. Give up yet. Got enough boons from Poseidon. The Master of the Seas, the Earthshaker, brother to Lord Hades and Lord Zeus. The Lord of Poseidon, I am ever grateful that while I was living, he was merciful to me. Down here, however, I must say I rarely feel his influence. All of us, we're beneath him now. How many of my brethren did he drown during my mortal days? He comes across as affable, yet I've not forgiven him. Lord Hades seems to have no love for him either, equating him to Zeus and shunning both alike. It's all a business best avoided by my estim estimation. So yeah, no love lost between them. Get another nectar, which I'm leaning towards, but I haven't seen the other reward. Oh, we can finally see who this thing is. Oh, but we don't have nectar to gift to him. That's fine. We can at least learn who is up here. The Elysium's moss-covered chambers, carved of stone, stand untold numbers of eternal monuments in tribute to the greatest heroes which mortality can offer, there to honor them in life as well as death. Okay, this place is near as gloomy as the house. So this guy must be a great hero of some kind. Well. Go on, stranger. Plenty more shades looking to fight with you out there. I'm just passing through. You seem less warlike than the rest. May I ask your name, sir? I'm Zagreus. Names are there to be forgotten, stranger. You shouldn't be here. May the fates favor your journey. But just in case they don't. Here, why don't you take this? Uh, touch the sticks dark. The next 15 encounters, your stubborn defiance restores 50% more health. That sounds pretty good. Your next five chambers, restore 30% health when you enter a chamber. Uh, Cyclops jerky select. For the next 10 encounters, your attack deals plus 60% damage. Oh, I like all of these. This we could potentially manipulate to have, I think, 80% health, if I'm reading that right. Thanks, sir. If that's your choice, then. Uh, Patroclus. So that's his name. Patroclus. Yeah, it's funny. We wouldn't have never known that. Forgive me. It's not my place to say much of him now. Huh. It's also an interesting entry. Oh, a shop that I'm not going to utilize. I guess we got the ovals. Where are my enemies? Here we go.
I think these guys are capable. Oh, this dash thing is actually kind of nice. Oh, took damage from something. Yeah, moving them around like that's pretty nice. Can't get too carried away though. Then I could hit them. Uh oh. gonna say, no real way of dealing with armor. Pain. I bet Charon's going to want all this. But yeah, already that stubborn defiance thing just helped out a bunch. Nope, we have nothing I want. Artemis! Who does not need a gift. We already gave it to her. this. We'll also wait for that thing to come back. Or not, maybe. You found me, Artemis. Let's see. You blundered headlong into danger for the past six chambers or more, and you made such a racket I could almost hear it from Olympus. I have to say your hunting skills are rather unconventional. Yeah, I'd have to agree about blundering headlong into danger. Oh, here we go. None of these are new, but we can finally get something to modify our attack. Uh, it's only an extra 38% damage, which is actually be less damage per hit. But we have a 15% chance at crit. It's going to be less damage because we're going to lose that keepsake value. Also, I heard a sound like maybe a fish. Yep, fishing spot right here. Hard to see, actually. I know you're out there, fish. Oh. I think that's enough. Well, I said I was too late, probably because I couldn't see that it was the right kind of catch. Because of the spot, with all the light glowing, I couldn't see the light pop up. Oops. Yeah, I'm failing at fishing up here. Do we go darkness or key? Well, we need to save up our keys, so we need like 20 of them for the next unlock.
don't think we try to manipulate stubborn defiance here. Now we get some gemstones. Okay, this one doesn't even have a fish to get. Go Hermes, we're shot. Sell off something if we really wanted. Want it again? Country army. Not much in the gem department. Excellent. But still fine. And we'll go see Hermes. Like I said, saving up our money. Oh, this is... Maybe we should have utilized... The, uh... Stubborn Defiance thing. That's fine. Hopefully. In the name of Hades. Your attack is faster. Have to use a call, gain dodge chance and move speed. Or a 15% dodge chance. I think we just go there a faster attack. Here we go. We've never beaten this guy with the sword. What hope of you, monster, versus the blessed bonds of brotherhood? Best not belittle him, King. He is more powerful than he appears. We must remain alert this time. Oh, I am perfectly alert right now, Asterius. And were I still alive, I would be positively salivating at the thought of running through this pustule with my spear, or whichever means I had available. Now let's go. This is bad. Not necessarily this Aphrodite, just the fact that he's in phase two while that guy is still up. Oh, 
triple dash is I think will help him out a lot. Dionysus' aid also came in clutch there. Who's champion now? Also kind of hurt that it put the other guy in a stage two. Must be something I can do with this. Before I was ready. That shade there. Have I got a fan? I do, and he smiled. Half, half friendo. All right. That was tough, but we made it. Should be another such performance soon. I suppose that I shall be seeing you quite soon. And we got plenty of gold now. Uh, we can swip, swap out this keepsake. Which still had one more encounter to rank up. That was take forever. What's this? In the final encounter in each underworld, region take zero damage the first three times foes hit you. So, for the boss. That's actually pretty nice. Uh, Owl Pendant, the next spoon you find will be from Athena. Let's try leveling up the Evergreen Acorn. Or, we could try utilizing Lucky Tooth to get another revive. I don't know which one takes precedence, though. We'll try that. Might help. We can also buy some Darkness. Which is fine. We spent a little bit of our money, but I think we're in a good spot. I can do this. I can do this. So even though we didn't get our duo the world's win, entryway. like this is the first time we've gotten up here without that combo. These urns have coin in them. At least I think. I think it's actually our only second time up here. So yeah, I guess it would be the first time without that combo. I think one of those noises was for a fish. The vast temple of Styx and its innumerable dangers now are all that separates the underworld prince from the land outside, which he so desperately longs to see. I've almost made it. Uh, let's just see what kind of rewards we got. I'm gonna go try to find that fish. So more obols to buy things. These two, which would be too late for that duo boon. Some health, which couldn't hurt. And what about the shop? Alright, there is a fishing spot. We'll buy a Titan's blood. Thank you, mate. We could buy a palm of power, Fishing time. but if we do get any more money, try to save up for some boons. I got one. I got a stone wall. <laughs> oh, not Dionysus. Probably because we're near him. Uh. It would be under River Denizens. Stonewall. The hard headed, harpoon nosed Stonewall is an elusive species that feeds on lesser river creatures that dwell too close to the gates of the underworld, slaying them so that their little souls may then be eligible for the rest of the journey. Ah, oh, they're helping out the little guys. Can't talk to him. Let's go talk to Cerberus. Back on duty, huh? Oh, we can't talk to him until we get the sack. Okay. Why can't we? I thought he might have something witty to say. So... What do I go first? Probably the health. Hi. Dead. That's right, these guys also have a ton of health. Definitely need those crits. Oh, uh, we also need to pay attention to that stubborn defiance. Does it go down after each of these chambers? So we're at 10 right now.
Yep, yeah, now we're at nine. So it won't last for too much longer. So that's not something we'll be able to utilize. Breaking so much stuff so fast, I can't tell if we're picking up ovals or not. Awesome, he's got to put poison everywhere. Nope, apparently we didn't take any poison damage. Or it went away in time. It's just a tiny vermin. Oh, God. Tiny vermin, huh? Got a lot of health. And he does a lot of damage. And he's evasive. Summons big boys. None of this is good for me. And a poison. Heal that up. Use a stubborn defiance first. We might end up being bolder, to be honest. Excellent, hit the wrong button there. Freaked out. Oh, we're in trouble. This thing's tough. Holy crap. Oh, and that was fast coming at me, too. I don't know how to fight that thing. Like, that's tougher than half the bosses we fought. Mm, that blasted tiny vermin. Agreed. 